After previously sparking controversy for using the Red Cross symbol without permission, Cube Entertainment has finally addressed the issue. Cube Entertainment has issued an apology following backlash over Idol's recent stage outfits. The controversy arose after fans and netizens criticized the group's costumes for being inappropriate and culturally insensitive. The agency acknowledged the concerns and expressed regret for any discomfort caused. They assured fans that they will take steps to prevent similar issues in the future, emphasizing their commitment to respecting cultural sensitivities and maintaining a positive image for their artists. Idol received criticism for wearing outfits featuring the prohibited symbol during their performance on Music Bank while promoting their latest song. In an exciting achievement, Espos track Supernova has been honored as the best song of 2024 by the esteemed music publication Dork. This accolade underscores the group's innovative musical direction and their ability to captivate a global audience. Supernova has been praised for its dynamic production, powerful lyrics, and the group's stellar performance, which together create an unforgettable listening experience. Since its release, the song has dominated charts and resonated deeply with fans, further establishing Espa as a powerhouse in the K-pop industry. Furthermore, Supernova has dominated the weekly charts of major domestic music sites Melon and Genie from July 15 to 21, holding the top spot for nine consecutive weeks. This extends its record as the longest-running number one song released this year, showcasing its unparalleled popularity both domestically and internationally. Rose of Blackpink continues to make waves with her solo career, as her hit singles On the Ground and Gone have achieved significant milestones in the United States. On the Ground is now eligible for platinum certification, while Gone is eligible for gold certification, highlighting her remarkable success as a solo artist. These certifications are a testament to the widespread popularity and impact of her music on a global scale. Speaking about Rose, today Rose surprised fans with her debut in the OST for the second season of Pachinko Rose performed Coldplay's Viva La Vida, which she had covered two years ago, as a gift for her fans. Through her Instagram broadcast channel, Rose also revealed that this OST will be part of the trailer and finale of the second season of Pachinko. Blackpink's Lisa has been named the newest house ambassador for Louis Vuitton, cementing her status as a global fashion icon. This announcement is notable not only for her partnership with the luxury brand but also for her return to her iconic full bangs, a hairstyle that has become synonymous with her image. Louis Vuitton celebrated this collaboration with a stunning photo shoot showcasing Lisa's elegance and style, aligning perfectly with the brand's commitment to innovation and craftsmanship. Her influence continues to grow, making her a perfect fit for the role. Lisa also going trending at first position on Weibo in China both at entertainment and recommendations categories, after she was announced as the newest brand ambassador of Louis Vuitton. Not stopping there, Lisa also going trending world witty in Twitter and become the most hot search topic among netizens as she is announced the newest house ambassador of Louis Vuitton. On July 17, the Television Academy revealed the nominees for the 76 TH Emmy Awards, including HBO's series The Idol for Outstanding Choreography for Scripted Programming. The nomination highlights the dance scene featuring Blackpink's Jenny and Lily Rose Depp performing to World Class Sinner, choreographed by Nina McNeely. In this category, The Idol competes with only murders in the building, Paul Morial, and Physical. In 2023, Forbes noted Jenny's significant role in the idol, praising her acting and dancing skills. The scene quickly went viral as fans imitated Jenny's captivating dance moves. Black Swan has released another jacket teaser for the second member, NV. In this stunning teaser image for Black Swan's first EP, Roll Up, NV exudes elegance and sophistication, set against a backdrop of rich, vintage decor. She wears a striking red dress with intricate ruffled detailing that accentuates her graceful figure, perfectly harmonizing with the room's opulent atmosphere. The room is adorned with ornate gold frames and classic artwork, adding to the luxurious ambience. Nvi's hair is styled in glamorous waves that elegantly frame her face, highlighting her exquisite features and radiant beauty. Her pose is both confident and alluring 
drawing the viewer in with her captivating gaze. The warm lighting enhances the scene, casting a soft glow that accentuates her flawless complexion and the deep red of her attire. This image not only captures Nvi's stunning beauty but also her commanding presence, setting the stage for Black Swan's much-anticipated release and showcasing the group's sophisticated style and artistry. Speaking of Black Swan, the composers for the title track roll-up have been gaining attention. Lauren Dyson composed the track alongside Rob Grimaldi. Lauren Dyson is renowned for creating songs for SM and JYP artists such as Red Velvet, Tion from SNSD, ITZY, and the legendary girl group Girls' Generation. Fans' expectations for Black Swan's comeback have risen due to the involvement of someone with experience in the big three agencies now working on Black Swan's title track. Exxon has been announced to join the fan community platform from, where fans can communicate privately with idols. Exxon becomes the next idol to join this platform. To welcome X into From, Exxon and From will hold a special event where fans will receive special signed Polaroids from Exxon. Speaking of the community platform, today X and Niz will appear in the Secret Room Tour with Xamada, where Niz will perform Soul's song, Um Um. Additionally, fans can leave various questions for X in, which will be answered in X in's third fan meeting with Xamada. Speaking of X in members, Hannah and Isha greeted fans through a live session today, starting with Hannah on pop stage followed by Isha on YouTube live streaming. Regarding X in fans, Exxon is currently in a concerning position for the Dream Rookie voting, standing at 14th place this week. The second round will end on August 8, in about two weeks. Fans need to push Exxon into the top 10 to continue voting in the third round. Speaking of Exxon, it was reported today that Exxon has been filming new content, which Arya described as something new and fun. In a recent pop live broadcast, Arya mentioned that Exxon was filming today, but did not confirm when it will be released. Secret Number will soon embark on their first tour, Secret Number, Unlock Tour in US, on July 27. It is likely that Secret Number will depart for Chicago on July 24 or 25. For their first tour, Secret Number appears to be preparing performances from each new unit within the group. A spoiler countdown video released by Secret Number shows that three new units will be showcased during the tour. These units are performing dances not from Secret Number's releases, sparking fans' curiosity. This is expected to be a surprise for fans in the US. Speaking of surprises from Secret Number, Sudam and Zhu recently delighted fans with their first OST, Love Love, marking the group's third OST. Sudam and Zook contributed to the OST for the latest Korean drama, Serendipity's Embrace. The OST has achieved over 30,000 streams on YouTube Music.